The wait is finally over. Today is Friday, April 29th, and that means it is Sentio Day. Martin Garrix's debut club album is finally out. I am so excited to hear the rest of the songs on Sentio. For the past month, I've been reacting to about half of the singles, all of the ones that were released on Tuesday and follow. I have already reacted to. So if you want to see my reaction to those songs, I'll leave a link at the end of the video and in the description. I am going to be jumping around the track list a little bit. I couldn't be happier that this album is finally out now. There are so many bangers on this album and I've only heard like half of it. And I'm so proud of Martin for all of these awesome collabs and like finally getting to collab with Zed. Like that's an awesome accomplishment and I'm so glad it's on Sentio. If you don't know, Sentio is actually Latin and it is a verb that means to feel or to experience. So I really like that kind of meaning for the album. It's going to be a whole experience, a whole feeling. He has played most of this album, if not all of it, live at festivals recently. So you're definitely feeling and experiencing the album live and I can't wait to hear it live. So the first song off Sentio is Follow with Zed and I have heard that. The second song is Limitless with Mesto. I've heard that. And the third song is Reboot with Valar. I have heard all of those three. So the next song up that I haven't heard that I'm going to be reacting to first in this video is Quantum with Brooks. I love we're getting another Brooks and Martin Garris collab. This is gonna be fire. Okay, starting off with a nice melody. Oh yeah, I remember this ID. Ooh! Goosebumps. I hear kind of like a guitar layered in. I love that. Definitely Martin Garrix with the guitar. I bet the drop might be more Brooks, but we'll see. I think I hear a little vocal chop also in the background a little bit, very subtle. Oh, here's the drop, I can't wait. Oh yes, I love this. Classic Brooks, classic Martin Garrix. It reminds me a lot of Bite. I love that, so nostalgic. Oh yeah, this is definitely giving me the same feeling that Bite did. I'm so glad it's like bringing me back to that feeling. This is a banger. Oh, I love the bass line as well. I love that part. Ooh! I love that. I love these synths too, like, the sound design is amazing. Ooh, what's this? Oh my gosh, classic Brooks break. That's mainly why I love Brooks, for this stuff right here. Super catchy melody. It's super fun and bouncy. I love everything about this, oh my gosh. I like that ending too. So that was Quantum. That was definitely worth the wait. It sounded very nostalgic, like bringing me back to like the Bite era and like kind of early Martin Garrix music, more progressive house. I really love the melody and the production. The sound design was amazing and I love Brooks's break. Like I said, I just love what he does. Next up, song number five off of the album is Good Morning by Martin Garrix and Matisse and Sadko. And I already reacted to that. So I'm going to go to the next song, song number six, and that is Starlight in parentheses keep me afloat and that is a collab with dub vision and i'm probably gonna butcher his name but sean ferugia i'm not sure how to say it i think that's how you say it um sorry if i mispronounced it if i remember correctly martin actually found this guy off a of tiktok and he loved his voice so he reached out and he wanted to collab with him and so they've made two songs together so far so that's an awesome story and this guy sounds like he's gonna be really great i think this is the first song off the album with actual like lyrics i mean other than follow but that was just one verse so i'm really excited This sounds super upbeat, very different from the songs I've heard so far. I like the chords too. I love this so far, a nice tambourine I think I hear. He's got a really great voice. Oh yeah, I love this melody too. Oh my gosh! Oh yeah, definitely Dub Vision. I love this, another great Martin Garrix and Dub Vision collab. Wow, that was great. The job was really good. This Sean guy, he is like super underrated, so I'm really glad that Martin's like really making him more popular. So this is really great because he's got an amazing voice. I feel like this one's gonna be a fan favorite. This is like classic Martin Garrix, you know? Synths sound good, sound design again, I really love it. Great production. I love these lyrics so much. Super uplifting and happy. I feel like the song could have like been great on its own without Sean's vocals, but this just like 
brings it up to another level. Like, honestly, it's so great. It reminds me a lot of High on Life, that very nostalgic, upbeat, happy feeling. This is like High on Life 2.0. Oh, I like how his voice kind of echoed at the end and like faded out. That was great. This one didn't have like a crazy drop or like a crazy bass, you know? This was like like the high on life style of music. I love that for Martin. Like this song was just overall like so magical. It gives you such an amazing feeling. I love it. Starlight is such a beautiful song. I hope it gets super popular, like just as popular as High on Life because I feel like this song has so much potential. Song number seven is called Funk with Julian Jordan, and I've already heard that, so I'm gonna go to song number eight. Song number eight is called Find You. It's a collab with Justin Milo, and I think his name is pronounced Dwayne Whitmore. Wow. It's so beautiful, the atmosphere and the chords. The chords are amazing. Oh my gosh. This guy's voice is awesome as well. Yeah, this is reminding me of Starlight. Super uplifting, beautiful track. Oh my gosh, I love this. I love these lyrics, how it's referring to like space. That's so cool. I like the theme of it, like with space, stars, dreaming, like what I just said. That's so cool. And I love the music video too. It's, it's lots of cool images of space and everything, which I love. I love astronomy, so that's really cool. Great melody. I like this kind of break before. Yeah, like the break before the drop where it's just the melody, instrumental. Oh yeah, I love this. Perfect collab for Justin Milo and Martin Garrix. Love these lyrics, right to the end of the time to find you. That's awesome. We can never get enough of Justin Milo and Martin Garrix collabs. I'm so glad with Sento, he's like bringing back other artists, like his friends that he's collided with years and years ago, like Julian Jordan. I'm so glad that this is another awesome progressive house track. Like Sento has everything I love. Progressive house, tech house, electro house, deep house, like it's a great mix of everything. I love this part of the song. The instrumental just build up to the drop and then they bring back the last part of the lyric right to the end of time. Love that. Sick drop. Oh my gosh, I love this melody. It's awesome. It fits really nice with the lyrics. That was way longer than I expected. A beautiful song. I loved how melodic it was, which I expected because it's Justin Milo and Martin Garrix, but it was so great. I love the melody. Again, like the lyrics were awesome. Probably my favorite part. And the chords were just like they hit you in the feels, you know? Find You also had a very nostalgic feeling to it. Song number nine is called Aurora and it's a collab with Blinders, which I already reacted to this past Tuesday. Next up is song number 10, which is called Oxygen and it's a collab with Dub Vision and Jordan Grace. I'm super excited to hear Oxygen. It's been teased for a very long time. I like it already. I like this vocalist, Jordan Grace. Never heard of him, but it sounds really good. I can hear hints of the melody coming in. I love it so far, really nice atmosphere. I've been waiting so long for this ID to come out and I'm so glad it's finally here and on Sentio. It fits great with the rest of the album. I can't wait for the drop. Ooh! I love this. Sounds a little bit like Brooks, but it's definitely dub vision. <laughs> I love the energy in this song, it's amazing. Very hype. Ooh! I like this a lot. The sense and the melody in this verse right now, I love it. Ooh, this part's interesting. I think I hear an arp. I love how they pulled back the layers in the verse, but you can still hear part of the melody. I love that. Oh, I love this part too. The arp sounds awesome. Oh my gosh, I love this song. Oh, I hear like a vocal chop too. Awesome. Well, the structure of this song is just totally unexpected. I like that break though, it was great. Ooh, harmonies, awesome. I really love this. I'm really feeling this one. Might be one of my favorites. Ooh, this one also kind of echoed out at the end. I mean, 
the last lyric was all i hear is your echo so i've never heard of jordan grace but he did such an amazing job on the song i really love it his voice just elevated the song as much as i love the drop i think i like the verse a little bit better especially the second verse like there's just something about it the vibe the atmosphere and you can still hear like layers of the melody in there but it wasn't super overpowering we're finally down to the very last song on sentio song number 11 and that is if we'll ever be remembered so this is the other collab that martin did with sean i've heard very great things about this song so i'm super excited to hear it i can't believe this is the last song it went by so fast starting off very simple just the vocal and guitar incredible lyrics like oh my gosh so inspiring so upbeat and happy very emotional too i feel like overall this is a very emotional song oh it's just the vocal right before the drop or build up <laughs> Kind of a fake out. All right, here's here's the drop. Nice. I like the melody a lot. Really simple. Oh my gosh. The drop was a little bit shorter than I expected. I thought it was gonna go on for another like four to eight bars. I love all the guitars in the song. Sounds like there's a rhythm guitar and a lead guitar, at least in some of the verses and stuff. Really cool. Oh my gosh, those high notes he just hit. So great. I kind of like this part. Oh, I hear strings too. Like I said before, Martin loves his strings. Of course he had them in this song though. Perfect choice. Oh, I like the background vocals too. Really nice layering with the vocals. Great job. I hear an arp as well. Spices things up a little. Because I feel like overall the song's pretty simple. Not a whole lot of layers and stuff going on. Like, it doesn't sound like a super big production compared to the other songs. Like, Follow sounded big and huge, and this song is like the complete opposite. Which was probably on purpose though, because this is the last song and Follow was the first. Yeah, so what I was saying is like, this song sounded super, like, minimalistic, kind of stripped down, not a whole lot of layers and big sounds and synths going on. Very simple and like, easy to listen to, which I feel like was perfect for the vibe of this song. It definitely helped create that emotional atmosphere and it just overall is a really great song so yeah that is it i just finished reacting to the entire album i feel like right now follow is my number one favorite just because i absolutely love zed and i've been a fan of his for a long time and so to finally get that martin garrix and zed collab and it's awesome just makes it that number one for me so follow was probably my number one favorite followed by limitless funk and oxygen i just really love the vibe of those songs let me know your guys's favorite songs off of sentio there were so many different genres and styles of music in this album mixed together and I thought it was a really great variety and he had a ton of awesome collabs and amazing vocalists on this album. I really love this direction that Martin's going with with his music and I just can't wait to hear more of his new songs, especially Stuck in a Loop. Kind of a bummer that wasn't in the album, but I really hope we get that one soon. And that's it. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you liked it, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!